I'm hoping this will be a nice, quick and easy tutorial. This tutorial will be about how to connect a listing made on Cordial um, to Etsy. So linking the Cordial design to the Etsy page. So here I have three designs, which are all duplicates basically, but different sizes. So I've got A5, A6 and 5x7. So really and truly, I only need to click on one of them. I don't need the rest of them. Um, I will be linking these three designs to one listing, but I'll show you how to do that. So I'm just going to go ahead and close the ones I don't need. And I'll just keep one that I do need. And um, so what you have to do is you have to go to info. OK, so let's say you've done your design, you've designed everything you need. Um, I've already gone ahead and designed my mock-up mock-ups for the listing. So I'll just show you. So I've already made my mock-ups here. So I've already saved these images. I'll be uploading them shortly. So what I have to do now is you go to info and then you go to li um, listings. And I haven't set any at the moment. So I'm going to do, so I'm going to quickly give this a name. I'm going to call it Yuka one okay you're gonna press save all right so attach to another listing so this should come up so what you do is you um this should come up but i'm not going to go there what i'm going to do is i'm going to click on yuka one okay it's going to take me to a different page now okay so it's going to take me here right so this over here it gives you the demo link which obviously you'll be putting into your description box um you can add some tags in here so you can put like wedding invitation you can put you know um instant download you can you know you add in your tags here so the important bit here at the moment is the etsy listing id so what i have to do now is i need to go and i need to create a new listing okay so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to create a new listing. So, um, <clears throat> so I have fast forwarded this video and I'm going to just upload a, so as I was saying earlier, because this is a digital product, you do have to upload something and obviously you can't upload the cordial link. Um, so what I've done is I have gone to, let me find it, it's a cordial customer instruction. So I've saved that as the PDF and that's what's going to be uploaded with the customer purchase. Um, so I'm just going to go over everything. So, you know, I put the quantity, the price, I'll come back and finish off the tags afterwards. I've done the description in the link and the link. Um, I've done the you know, the title and I've got my images. So now I'm ready to basically publish this um, listing. So what I do is I publish. Yes, I want to publish. And now you've got an active listing. So if you go to your listing, you should see a number at the very end of the link. So what you need to do is you just need to copy that number. So you copy and go back to cordial or cordial and then you add your then that will be your etsy listing id so you paste that right and you press save okay so after that so i've saved it so after that you go to listings okay and then you see if you have been able to link your shop with the item that you want so obviously i've got now two items on cordial that have been linked this is the one here that i've just recently done um you should have an e sign for etsy um showing you that it's been linked now as i was saying earlier i do want to link this design with three other designs in different sizes so add so i go down here and i go to add designs to listings and then I have to come here and choose which one I've got. So at the moment I've got Eucalyptus 5x7. I want to get the A5 and the A6. So you double click the A5. It will pop up here. 
double click the A6, it'll pop up here, and you press done. Okay, so now you've got three, you save again, then it will take you straight to listings and it will show you how many designs you have. So it will say, you know, designs, I've got three designs. So this is three designs in one listing. So the customer, when they purchase this design, they will get all three sizes. Um, and its expiry is in basically a year. You can change this if you want to. Um, but, you know, the nature of this project, weddings can always be, be postponed. So it's better to give your clients more time. Anyway, I really do hope that has helped. Um, give me a thumbs up. Let me know if that has been helpful. Thank you for watching. Bye.